Merry Christmas beer buffs and today I'm re reviewing this stout called Lump of Coal and it's from Ridgeway Brewing so let's get a pour on shall we? Ho ho ho! <laughs> I hope you have all had, all had a very Merry Christmas. Oh, oh, ho, oh, hold my beer and I should put it in there. But this is a big bottle, so it's not really gonna work too well. But yeah, let's get, this is my first, uh, my 12 beers of Christmas, as I promised. Um, not sure about the top, it looks like it's kind of waxy. So, oh gosh, I may struggle to open this one. <laughs> um, I should have bought a knife. <sighs> Let's try and do that, shall we? I wasn't sure if it was like, um... God, this is embarrassing. Using my teeth. Um... One minute. So here's one I made earlier. <laughs> what am I like? Sorry about that. Um... That's better. That's better. I have to get the scissors out. And so this is a 7.5%. And like I say, it's from Ridgeway Brewing. And it's imported by Shelton Brothers to uh, Belchertown, USA. But the actual brewery itself is in England. It's in South Stoke, Oxfordshire. So there you go. Let's get pour on. I'm looking forward to this. My first one. For the Christmas reviews um, and it's a stout what a treat so it's it's labeled as a kind of a bittersweet uh, chocolate stout so uh, full pint there as you can see I've got my little stein glass for this um, dark holiday I got a few I got quite a few Christmas beers I had one called Krampus but I, that's a bit strong so I'm gonna save that um, Maybe that'll be towards the new year, but not much scent to it, I'll be honest with you. Mmm, oh, that is a bitter, bitter chocolate taste. Light, not too thick, actually. I would um, describe its um, consistency as that to um, Guinness but much sharper and bitter compared to Guinness, I have to say. Well, that's good fit, play. I like the bottle as well. Very Christmassy. This brewery do a lot of Christmas beers, and I'll talk a bit of that, about that in a minute. But um, yet another bummed out holiday, lump of coal, dark holiday stout is liquid consolation. Okay, um, I've had a wonderful Christmas, I've got to be honest. We had turkey yesterday and uh, all the presents and stuff. I had one of those rumba vacuum things to go around and do all the vacuuming for me. So that was my big Christmas gift. Fair play. Santa was looking out for me there. Save all that sweeping. There's a lot of floor to sweep in here. I uh, hope you all had a Merry Christmas and plenty of lovely uh, craft beers and ales and such. And uh, obviously it's not over. It's Boxing Day today, so Hopefully you're getting your fill. I certainly am. <laughs> Good way to start Boxing Day off this. Fair play. Anyway, the brewery itself, um, Ridgeway Brewing. As I said, it's uh, South Stoke, Oxfordshire. Oxfordshire is a beautiful county. I've driven through there a few times and obviously been to Oxford a few times. Um, beautiful place, you know, beautiful part of the world. But it's run by a guy called Peter... Sholly, I hope I'm pronouncing that right, Peter. And basically the, the brewery itself takes its name from the ancient long distance footpath, which passes near the brewery itself in South Stock. So have a look, check out their website. Um, they've got some fine beers listed. Um, check them out. And if you're in that area, you know, uh, Oxfordshire, just go and have a look. I, I, next time I'm in Oxfordshire, I'll definitely chalk this brewery up for sure. But yeah, it's um, it's very nice. I'm enjoying this. Of course, Lampaco being 
traditionally you get a lump of coal in your stocking to help fuel the fire. Oh, by the way, I turned the fire off today. It was so distracting last time and it, uh, the good wife said it sounded like uh, plastic crackling, you know? So uh, I thought, you know, just go with the ambience of the tree and, uh, you know, a bit easier to listen to me, <laughs> if you will. Um, yeah. So yeah, fair play, this is nice. Um, a couple of beers at this brewery do if you can find them. They incidentally, you can find this brewery over here. They do export quite a bit. The brewery itself, I was reading and um, yeah, they export all over, particularly here to the USA. So fair play on uh, Ridgeway Brewing. Uh, if there's any background noise, it's my kiddo having some, talking to his buddy, you know, all the Christmas presents, all the excitement. He did well, go. He did very well. Um, so a few beers that they do, they have one, oh, rather humorous, Santa's Bat, it's called an it's a porter, so probably a little bit lighter than this. Uh, they do a winter ale called Bad Elf. Now they have a few of these elf ones, they have um, Bad Elf, Terrible Elf, there's, there's quite a few, you know. The elves get worse. <laughs> they do one just called IPA, so you can tell what that is. Um, they have a dark ale, sounds nice, called Bad King John. I'd like to find that one. And they also have a pale ale called Ivanhoe. A lot of history there, you know, of uh, British history. Uh, yeah, as for this, Fair Play is cracking. It's a good start to the 12 beers of Christmas. And I, folks, um, no humbug here, by the way, <laughs> I, folks, I'm going to come in straight away. Solid uh, Boxing Day 8 for me. So cheers to Ridgeway Brewing. I will see you tomorrow for my next beer. So until then, season's greetings. Ta-ra.